Hey guys, uh, so if you're watching this video, that means that you um, saw my video on my old channel, EFS Photography. I uh, just wanted to make a new channel. I'm going to start this channel off, I'm going to do an update on my camera bag. You know, that was a year ago. A lot of stuff's changed, you know, you pick up new stuff. And I uh, excuse my loud breathing, I have a tendency to breathe loud. I don't know why, I just do. So, um, I'm still, I still have the Low Pro AW200, um, what do they call it, the, uh, slingshot that's it so um you know I'll start with the boring stuff rear lens cap lens pen you've all seen these you know the brush um low pro card wallet got that um ml l3 this stuff's like all the same I think I had all this but it's just in a different compartment um Quick release plate for my Quanta Ray tripod body cap. And by the way, a Quanta Ray, that's Ritz Cameras brand. They actually do make some quality stuff for the price. I mean, not quality, but good for the price. Um, two, S two gig USB flash drive. Always good to have one of these around. Let's see if this is in frame. I'm going to check to make sure it's in frame because I don't have a camera and I'm just on a tripod. Um, uh... This is a Copper Hill Images um, lens cleaning kit, and these are real nice. That little dustproof case, real nice. Um, it's like a microfiber. It's not a chamois. It's a microfiber. Some good lens cleaning solution. Um, two booklets of lens tissue, and these ultra brushes, which are pretty sweet. You know, it's a real, real soft brush. It's better than lens pen brush. Put all this back in here. Don't want to go over 10 minutes or let my battery die. Gyodos Rocket Air. These are great. I'm thinking about cutting the feet off of it. They get in the way. Um, and I'm not going to pull it out because it's a pain to get back in, but you can see. Well, actually, you can't see. I'm going to try to make it so you can see. Yeah, I got my battery charger back there. Ow, I just got a Charlie horse in the bottom of my foot. Anyway, um, so yeah, we'll get to the interesting part now. There's that cloth, the uh, lovely little cloth. There's my D40. Pop the clips. And now, as you can see, I truly had this thing packed to its fullest ability. Um, right off the bat, you got my D40 mounted with the big old beast of a lens, the 70-300 VR. Um, it's a, this is an excellent lens. I mean, it really is a great lens. Um, you can pick them up real cheap used for the quality of the lens, and it's a great big long lens. Some of you might even need to get a new bag to uh, fit this lens because it is a gigantic lens. So I got that. Um, this is the AFS DX 35 millimeter, you know, 52 threads, um, 1.8. This is a great lens too. Um, great, uh, you know, you can really do some uh, interesting stuff with this lens. And you know, it's really nice to. Sometimes you want to test your ability, go out with just a fixed um, lens, and see what you can come back with. You know, my trusty old. Um, 18 to 135 here. Haven't used this in a while, and after using the 70 to 300 um, exclusively for a little while, actually, uh, I can feel that this is really, you know, you can tell the build quality difference between the two when you feel them. So, I'm, like, after you use one for a while, you can really feel the difference. And I think I'm really going to feel the difference in a minute. Um, over back here, I have my close-up 52mm filter set. Keeps me from buying a macro lens, you know, save some money, get to buy some other glass. 55-200, no VR, with hood. You know, this is standard, like, step-up kit lens. Well, actually, it's not a kit lens, but it's like the step-up lens, you know what I mean? 
and then my 1855, which is my my macro lens with the close-up filters. You know, um, so here's my glass over there. You know, I have five lenses now, uh, with my filter set. So that essentially makes it like I have tons of different macro lenses in theory. So yeah, um, I'm just going to pack my bag back up now like I did in my other videos. So if you want to watch everything gets packed, you can do that. Um, otherwise, quit watching, comment, rate, subscribe. And honestly, I have not put anything up on my DeviantArt in the past couple months. I've stayed like just editing on my computer. I've been really busy with a lot of things this summer. Stuff went on, so um, I haven't. I don't have anything up on DeviantArt, and I'm not going to put anything up on DeviantArt. <coughs> um, I guess from now on, since I have my channel now, I will start to add stuff. So starting from if I go out and shoot tomorrow, I'll add stuff. But I'm not adding stuff from the whole time I I didn't post videos. So I'm going to pack my bag back up now. And I still have, I have a lens bag here to support. Okay, I just pulled the SD card out. Um, to support, because I have this uh, battery grip on here. And the slingshot really isn't made for a camera with a battery grip on it. Uh, 35 mil goes right there. Um, 18 by 135. I just pop the lens cap off of that, and um, all my lenses except for one, which the filter gets whips swapped around on, all my lenses um, have UV filters on them at all times, you know, you gotta protect your lenses. Um, oh, and I also have a lens cloth um, below my body, I didn't pull that out, I forgot, it's there. Um, because I usually take a microfiber and I put it in my shirt pocket. This cloth goes here. Swaps down. Like so. Battery's about to die, so if it cuts out, I'm sorry, I'm just going to leave it like that. And these bags are nice if you don't have a lot of big lenses or anything. They really are good lenses, uh, good bags. I'm thinking about getting, even though it's practically the same as this, um, except the layout's a little bit different. And, you know, I'm kind of not liking, um, you know, the little side tilt thing with this bag. It's kind of a pain because um, I can't really store a second body. I don't even have a second body, but if I did want to get one, I'd have no place to store it. Um... So, I'm thinking about getting the uh, DeviantArt Pro bag. If you guys have seen that, the DA Pro. And I've actually got to open this back up real fast. i to slip my filters. I slipped them on top of the 55 to 200. So, my filters go right there. Um, thinking about getting that bag, the way it's laid out, um, it has like a holster in the top. And I'm really liking that, so I'm thinking that might be my next camera-related purchase. Yep, so uh, there you have it, guys. That's my camera bag. Um, you know, comment, rate, subscribe. I'm going to have a lot of videos coming up. As you can see, I have a lot of stuff to review. I have no reviews. So all this stuff in this bag is going to be reviewed, everything. Um, even this tripod that this camera is sitting on, I'm going to review somehow. So, uh, yeah, just keep watching. Comment, rate, subscribe. Check out my DeviantArt for my old pictures and uh if you have any questions you can pm me and i'll i'm glad to help so uh thanks for watching and uh see you later